from Eat. Um, and a few numbers there. With a show like 24, the real-time gimmick seems like it can border on distracting and unrealistic at times, especially considering the traffic in L.A. Has, uh, <laughs> how much of a concern is keeping this real-time device realistic? Doesn't bother me at all. I mean, it's sort of a... I mean, yeah, you can't get across L.A. in 20 minutes. But, uh, <laughs> I mean, you can't, unless you're in a helicopter. Uh, so, uh, but that's... The, the, the device itself is a wonderful... Um, it keeps the tempo moving so fast. It keeps the, the hammer down so much. I mean, people tell me all the time how this is such, I mean, this make, show makes them crazy because of the intensity of it, and they sit at the edge of their chair and et cetera and watch it. I think that that device is more beneficial than it is detrimental. I mean, and, and, and you have to suspend your disbelief in any piece of art, you know. Uh, um, uh, movies are not totally real. <laughs> uh, by a long shot, they represent reality, but they're not reality. You mean so, those Star Treks you were on? Those weren't uh, those real. Star Treks you were on, and I saw the Bourne Ultimatum yesterday, and I went, oh, oh, but who cares? I mean, you know. Um, and that's how I think it is with 24, too. I mean, yeah, it's a general joke. Yeah, I would love to get across town that fast. Or or have cell phone link up at uh, such rapidity. Or you never lose your signal. I'm running, et cetera, et cetera.